Well, Bemidji Community Theater's latest production will have audiences saying, Toto, I have a feeling we're not in Minnesota anymore, as cast and crew bring the classic 1939 film, The Wizard of Oz, to the stage. Reporter Mary Balsett has more with this week's In Focus. It's a story almost everybody knows. One of courage, heart, brains, and home. And it's coming to the Bemidji Community Theater stage. This is uh, The Wizard of Oz. It's probably the most ambitious play I think that BCT has probably done. And there's just a thousand moving pieces. And I don't think that's an exaggeration. No, I think you're right. I mean, I think we probably could have started back in June to be real. I mean, that would have been plenty of time. There's only about a half dozen of us who are playing one role. And the, everyone else in the, in the ensemble is playing anywhere from two to six, yeah. I think, different roles. That's one thing when you're a grown-up and you can do that, but we're asking you know, young people. Yeah. The difference with ages and working with people mm -hmm. of all different ages and people that have, I mean, maybe there's eight people. It's their first show ever. Bemidji Community Theater's production of The Wizard of Oz stays true to the tale of Dorothy and her companions as they travel down the yellow brick road. However, director Mary Knox Johnson has her own vision when bringing this classic to the stage. She has some kind of uh, things that are very um, common to BCT, like the staircase. Right. <laughs> and the, spi and the, the, st uh, the spiral, the, roll the, the yes. spinning stage piece. She always has a revolving piece, yeah. or almost always has a revolving piece in her shows, and that makes it unique. Just like the characters, Bemidji Community Theater hopes audiences will also learn a lesson along the way to the Emerald City. If you look at the witches, they're really just two sides of the same coin. Mm -hmm. And so there's always a good side. There's always kind of a not so good side. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. the whole idea is to pay attention to your heart and be wise enough to listen, be wise enough to go back home, and be wise enough to embrace the magic. Reporting from Bemidji with this week's In Focus, Mary Balsted, Lakeland News. And tickets are currently on sale. Performances will be next week, November 11th through the 13th, and the week after that from November 18th through the 20th. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.